welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for joining me on this day. You know, adulting is definitely happening these days and I have been investing my hard-earned money and I'm so, so excited because I am about to jump in a Zoom and we are going to plan my latest investment with RLC Residences. I'm so, so excited because we are definitely going to make this place really really beautiful and we're very very hands-on and i'm just so so excited about this so you guys can join me during my zoom it's going to be super fun and with our interior designers astrid chris and of course my dear friend jewel who's helping me fix up my latest project with rlc so come on let's join Hi guys! Hello! So I'm so excited because we got a one bedroom unit which is perfect because one bedroom FYI is actually the best if you want to invest on something it's easy to rent out so in the future I'm going to rent it out but we're going to make it very different we're gonna maximize yes. the space so let's talk about that. Based on our previous discussion I was able to pick up points and actually created a deck to move to the next step. I would like to introduce architect Chris Bello and Astrid Bello. They are partners and they have this firm called Pibel A plus ID. So I asked them to be on board since I really can't do site visits as of this time. And it so happened that they're also good friends of mine and they definitely have this experience as design consultants. So I will be presenting to you my initial sketch. I remember it was a banter of exchange of ideas rooted yes. from your vision sketch. Definitely nilagay niyo yung divisions na gusto ko. Yes, definitely. And I also remember you were so inspired by RLC when they turned over you the unit and you immediately sent me the photos of the unit. As you can see on the screen, the condo unit is a plus minus 43 square meters, one bedroom unit. So I just basically enhanced the sketch that she gave me and just fine-tune according to the space proportioning and functionality based on your lifestyle. RLC is very generous in terms of giving adequate spaces for each designated rooms inside the unit. But we needed to tailor fit this unit in terms of her requirements and priorities. Initially, you really want to convert the bedroom into your office and bring out the bedroom outside. That's why I came up with the rearranging of the layout given by the RLC team. So since bringing your work to this condo is on top of your priorities, we just relocated the four dining table which is initially in the middle of the unit and just maximize the space. You wanted drapes. Sir. Actually, so, before I wanted railings but then mas soft in drapes. Yes, yes it is. This is for partitioning and privacy. Yeah. So from that point of view, heart, I came up with a modern minimalist gallery theme where I can project the drapes as a theme where I can, you know, this is the basic table material inside an exhibition or gallery. Since you are a creative person and a CEO, I really want to highlight these aspects of your life and really focus on just being creative and being entirely different from your previous and current properties. So this space that we were going to be creating will be your vision board. We start with clean canvas and mostly white, very l and &E, injecting your core values, calm and classy, curated and crafted. Just textures, lines, so eventually it can be filled up with different kinds of curated pieces. So I love how you mix the different textures of the whites. I also like where you put all like the stuff that inspires me, memories, photos. I love also the combination of like the tinge of the coral, the gold. I love everything. I'm so, so excited. I also love the door. Thank God for that door. I love it how RLC really gave us a space where we were actually able to work around the beautiful foundation that they already had. This is just fantastic. I cannot wait to visit. How long is it gonna take? Charat. Okay guys, that's it. There you go. It's gonna take them a few months to get that look. I'm also so excited because if you're like me and you have this kind of space, we are going to show you how to turn it into a home. A space that'll make you, you know, inspired and just really dress it up. So I'm so excited for you guys to see and I'm excited myself.
we are here already in Ortigas. We're on our way to Sapphire Block. I'm so, so excited. I mean, I've seen the process. I've seen how, you know, we fixed it up. We pimped it up. And I'm just so, so grateful to RLC because they gave us a wonderful foundation that we can already work on. I'm so excited to see the finished product. It's just a few more minutes and we're there. We're home. This is our newest hangout place, like a little studio. As you can see, the lobby is so beautiful. It's like a hotel. And the amenities are just so perfect. Everything is here. Even when you step out, you're like in the heart of the city. And that's something that I also consider whenever I am looking for a place or whenever I invest on a nice property. It always has to be like near everything. So I love it. This was such a good one. I'm very proud of myself. Yeah. I love it. It's so, it's so nice. Hi. It's perfect. Hi. Chris and Astrid say hi. Hello. Of course, they designed this whole place and they did everything I expected. Ang ganda. The details of the chair. Since it's the first thing you see when you enter the yes. unit, we want it to seamlessly blend with the rest mm. of the spaces here. So that's why it's all white. But we made sure to include different textures of white because with white, there's a danger of looking flat. So that's why we included you know, this onyx I texture, love it. the counter, and then it seamlessly goes well with the kitchen. Yeah. So apparently they're connected now, and then you have the dining area. Yeah. Actually, we decided to use a counter-mounted cooktop. So when you have friends over and you're just going to have wine and cheese with them, yeah. you can tuck this away and you ah, get yes. to have extra space More on space. your counter. And here, you guys did what I requested. So beautiful, the curtains. Yes, and it highlights the high ceiling of yeah. the unit because the vertical lines of the drapes, it just accentuates the existing high ceiling. Yeah. And sa lagay na to, actually, nag-drop na tayo ng ceiling na oh, yan. Oh, eh. talaga? Yes. That's the nice thing about RLC is they really consider those things that even if you get like a one-bedroom, they make it high ceiling so it doesn't feel like you're confined in an area. We love that RLC was able to provide multiple windows on the other side of the unit. Yeah. So we decided to use double mm -hmm. swing doors so that we could maximize the amount of natural light coming through. I love through. that. So that's why the space here, it's well lit. Even if you have just one window over mm -hmm. there, because we could use the light coming yeah. from that side. And it's perfect. Lighting is always important, especially if you like taking pictures. Yes, <laughs> yes perfect yes, for you perfect. especially. <laughs> yeah, okay, so let's okay. enter. Wow, so nice. I love it. It's so beautiful. This is the office space. And of course, to explain our shelves. Yeah, since we mentioned during our previous meetings, it's important that you have a space where you can work and you can focus on your collaborations. We know that it's important to have this gallery wall where you can display things that inspire you or maybe um, current collaborations mm -hmm. or if you're brainstorming for packaging, let's say for Luxel or yeah. for your other brands. We also made sure that we provide you with this lovely desk for, yes, your, for working. Yes, I love it. So we love the texture here. And then of course, the mirrored wall that's actually a column on the existing unit. Oh, okay. So we cladded it with mirror. So nice. at least you won't notice the existing yeah. column and it becomes decorative as well. It makes it look spacious again. So this was the Chanel inspiration. Yes, yeah. this was inspired by an iconic staircase. area. The staircase yeah. at the Chanel showroom at Rue Cambon. So it's filled with uh, mirrored panels mm -hmm. similar to that one. So the idea is we want to multiply the reflection of yeah. heart. Because yeah. <laughs> you're so pretty, there oh should be God. multiple reflection <laughs> okay I love it and then here we have like our little area of course you need clothes you mentioned before that your clothes are works of art mm -hmm. so why not display them exactly. here instead of hiding them in closets yes so you have so many beautiful clothes mm -hmm. we should just openly and this is such a good idea because you know sometimes you don't want to constrict yourself to just a cabinet so again you can display your clothes anywhere because they are artworks mm -hmm. 
this was something that I was very happy to have. And you can just add drawers below yes. if you need something to conceal yes, your other. Yes, like stuff that you don't want, like yes. toiletries. <laughs> and of course, the one that I always wanted, I wanted a fireplace, but I don't have natin ng fire. So <laughs> they just put like plants behind, but you could still put like candles. You could also put seasonal decors there. Yes. So for Christmas, exactly. so again, an idea yeah. siya, or books. So yeah. you don't have to restrict yourself with just candles yeah. or plants. There are many things you could do with the mantelpiece. One of the things is it highlights a good paint. Yeah, this was actually a painting I did for Cherry Mobile. We did like a line from our battery pack, but we kept the sketch obviously and then they made it into a painting which is amazing because it's just this small. So that's nice. And I also like the color. It really matches with the rest of the yeah. interiors. And you know, Panda will be happy. Yeah, she will be happy. <laughs> yeah, happy should just. Yes. And now we go into the toilet, the loo. This was nice because it's a touch of bronze. It makes everything very luxe. So we changed that. But we kind of... We maintain the tiles. The tiles yeah, so tiles. we don't need to change them. Yeah, and of course we had to add the art. Astrid and Kirsty were inspired by my past paintings, my doodles. So we had an artist actually paint these beautiful mural. It was perfect because this was the existing wall of RLC. And also the tiles in the shower are also the existing yes, wall. I really yes. like that. The so. accent tiles work with the basin. Yeah. Um, I love it. We still have the mirror and the lamps were so beautiful. Especially if you put it on top of the mirror. Laka talaga ng difference and fresh flowers. No fake flowers for okay, today. Now, what makes this whole space different from the usual condo unit. What I love about the RLC property is that when they turn over units, they provide cabinets, which mm -hmm. are very uh, convenient. And my favorite part is, of course, the high ceiling. Yes. It feels so spacious. Mm -hmm. Even if we have already dropped the ceiling, it just feels so parang larger than the usual condo. And that's actually a hallmark for a premium development is yeah. when they can provide you with high ceiling high units. Ceiling. I also love that you have many windows. It's common for condos that you have just one window at the end mm -hmm. of the room and then that's it. But here you have good cross ventilation. Yeah. So if you open up all the windows, you have uh, natural ventilation and of course the light coming from the outside yeah. makes it feel so cozy. And spacious as well, not suffocating. So that's what I also love about the space of RLC. When I first saw the unit, I was like, oh, it's really open and it's really nice. It's nicely lit. And you know, we were able to reuse a number of materials, especially for the toilets. It's easy to work with it blends well with most designs yeah. they provide it as a canvas yeah. so that we can be creative on that blank wall mm -hmm. so i'm sure there are many others who have you know creative minds like you who could use it yeah. as an artwork what i like about it is we didn't change the toilet everything was already quality so that was really really nice kumbaga sulit sa investment every time we go here for site visits we love going through the lobby it's yeah. so well designed yeah. the art deco style mm -hmm. it's so glamorous when mm -hmm. you step inside like the lobby yeah. It is like a hotel. Every space here within the property is just well designed, even mm -hmm. down to the smallest accessory. Yeah. You know that they thought about it. So, nakita nyo naman na mas malaki yung workspace kesa sa bedroom. Why did we do this this way, Astrid? We know that you're a person with so many interests. Mm -hmm. So, you work on so many things, you have so many collaborations. So, it's important that we tailor the space planning mm -hmm. based on your lifestyle. Mm -hmm. So, since you need some space to work, um, you need to focus on your collaborations and you need to meet with guests and mm -hmm. partners. We have to devote a significant amount of space for your studio. And then the rest of the spaces can be designed in such a way that you still have a dining area, you have exactly. a receiving area, and you have a sleeping area. So we didn't really sacrifice anything mm -hmm. by providing this spacious office. Yes. So everything was well balanced. The original layout of RLC was perfect to work around with. They really give you space for you to play around around if you do want to kind of change it up a bit. It was really, really nice. For some properties, you would find the odd column somewhere or, yes, you know, yeah. that's difficult to work with. But for this one, everything was so clean and easy to plan. Well planned. So the non-negotiables are like special requests. Well, first, I would say I'm not a minimalist. I'm a maximalist. So we can talk about that. On the surface, you would think that oh, this is not hard style because mm -hmm. it's minimalist or parang polished and modern. But actually, when we were thinking about it, when we saw how you approached fashion, you look so beautiful in a voluminous gown, 
but we're equally impressed with how you look in a tailored suit. Okay. So that's how we thought about the process. Eh? Because eh, you can be equally beautiful and different personalities yeah. or parang different ways you express your yeah. pa parang fashion sense. Yeah. So similar to interior design, eh, you can have this maximal style mm -hmm. on other properties. Yeah. For this unit, since this is related to your work or collaborations, we feel that it's important that we provide you a clean canvas yeah. to work on. So you can have paintings here, you can play around with your, how we place accessories. It's free to design based on your whims. The special requests, like the fireplace. <laughs> yes. Since it's very hot in the Philippines, yeah. we can't really have a fireplace. No. So we just provided a mantelpiece. Mm -hmm. So typically, mantelpiece is the part that's placed in front of the fireplace to catch the smoke. For this one, we use this as a, as a way to store plants, to mm -hmm. highlight the painting. Books, like what Books, you said. Books, yeah. and then seasonal decor. Mm -hmm. Imagine if you put like wreaths there, yeah. so it would be nice during Perfect. the Christmas. And of course, the division of the bed. The drapes. Yeah, that was also oh, we love something that I requested for. The drapes provide the richness and parang mm -hmm. soft feel to a modern and clean space. Because yeah. there are times na if there's a modern design, it tends to feel a bit cold. Yeah. So the drapes add warmth yeah. to the space and also they provide texture. Yeah. And like what I mentioned before, that it just further highlights the high ceiling of the yeah. space. Initially, because I wanted it to be like gated type wall, but then since we had the door already that was kind of structural, that was perfect to soften it up. The curtains provide privacy as yes, well, right? exactly. so you can rest while there are others working yeah, around in yeah. here. So multifunctional yes, yeah. drapes. Standing. Very New York. So it was interesting that we put the curtains to kind of separate the bedroom. Why is that so? Since we wanted the space to be mostly white, mm -hmm. we wanted to add texture to mm -hmm. the space. And the ripple folds created by the curtains, they provide the perfect contrast to the flat walls and yeah. the whole lime washed wallpaper. And then, of course, it adds privacy yeah. and then the softness to the feel of the space. So it's just a perfect partition without having to commit to a permanent wall. Yes. And I love it because it's also cream, it's white, it doesn't look heavy, so it doesn't also cut so much the spaces, it kind of also looks very open. The effect that we're after is that you don't see where one space ends and the other one begins. I love that, so yeah. Everything just seamlessly works together. Yeah, blends. So why a lot of mirrors? I love mirrors, but there's a scientific reason for that, and why is that? Well, one of the obvious reasons, of course, is to make the space feel larger. Mm -hmm. That's one of the known parent tips for interior design. But another thing is because we know you're into making Instagram reels yes, yeah. <laughs> helps with you creating your look. Exactly, so content. We have to base it on what you do on mm -hmm. a daily basis. So since you create different looks, yeah. it helps that you have mirrors everywhere. Yeah. And I love it. There's always something so luxe about having beveled mirrors. And you may also notice that we use different colors for the mirrors. Yes. That was intentional so that it doesn't feel repetitive or boring. Mm -hmm. On some parts, we use regular mirrors that are silver color. Yeah. And then on the other parts, we use beveled but in bronze color. Yes. And then on the kitchen, you'll notice that we use gray mirrors. Yes, naman. Yes. So different colors make Ganda. the space interesting. It was really nice. An open closet. Actually, a lot of people ask, ah, why there's clutter or whatever? It's really not clutter. It's how probably arrange it according to the color also. Because fashion is art. I didn't want also to be constricted with a cabinet. Yes, right? I agree. And one of the interviews I watched of you is the one from Harper's Bazaar. And you mentioned how clothes are works of art. Yes. So that stuck with me. And I wanted to make sure that even the smallest details, mm -hmm. like how we store your clothes, yeah. be associated with the things you say or how you go about your daily life. Yeah. So since you think that clothes are works of art, we should display them. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> and Very all your clothes are so pretty. So Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> we can just easily display them. You know, I love big grand tables, dining tables, where I can put up my plates, my setup. But but we did opt for a counter, yes. which is very different and not the usual, but why did we do that? Well, we saw from a number of your Instagram yeah. <laughs> posts that you cook, so I cook as well. Mm -hmm. And whenever I cook, it's nice that you have company mm -hmm. near you, so at least you don't feel alienated from yes, your guests. Yeah. So in that way, you get to have a dining area, but also a space where you can interact with your guests or your friends while you're preparing the food. Yes. So it becomes an activity also. Yeah. And I love that. Even when I paint, I like having people around there. And I do love, I always wanted a countertop. It just feels so cozy, the yes. bar 
parang sitting side by side with yeah. your friends. It's casual. It's mm -hmm. very again New York. Okay, so that was so fun. But I do have my last question for you, Astrid. For those that are renovating or fixing up their homes, their houses, their condo units. What tip can you give them? You don't have to follow a formula. So you have to think about how you live, how you work. So that's the starting point always. It's always you who decides yeah. what works for you. And then when you work with your interior designer or your architect, you have to communicate what your needs are so you can seamlessly work with the professionals. And what's nice about that is that when you have ideas, they can help you trim it down or maybe parang give you other ideas which you can consider. But the most important is you have to know what you want. Exactly. Even in life, you have to know what you want. So that's pretty much it. I really love it. Thank you so, so much, Thank Chris you also. and Astrid. <laughs> couldn't do this without you. Jewel, and I hope you guys enjoy the evolution of my beautiful unit here at the Sapphire Block of RLC Residences. This has been hard. Bye!